Hello everyone, it is Prodigy Queen again, and in this Prodigy video, we will finish taming Magma Ham and claiming the awesome new epic. Now before we begin this really exciting Prodigy video, don't forget to hit that like button, also make sure to subscribe to my channel, and hit the notification bell so you won't miss out on any of my Prodigy videos. So, um, as you know, in the, one of the, like, last, last, last videos, we finished taming, um, Mad Mayhem, like, just one-third, so just the charred fruit. So, um, you can click the small symbol at the top, the eye symbol, if you want to go ahead and watch that if you haven't watched it already. Today, we will be finished collecting all the obsidian and the lava rocks. So, first up is the lava rocks. We'll be heading over to um i believe shiverchal mountains also i just got my second corona vaccination yesterday so my left arm is a little bit sore but that's all right since, since i'm a righty let's go play in the shiverchal mountains so um as you can see new will always tell us that we need to go to the ice tower since we finished all these quests to go and free ada but we'll do that some other time let's go ahead and go into this jail looking door where we can throw frozen ice things and unfreeze them. Hopefully they won't be too soggy. And as you can see, we have two rascals here. So let's battle this first rascal to get to the snow lump. I think it's rascal is, I think rascal is still its name. I forgot actually. Did they change it? Also, I got a new avatar makeover. Oh, it's a Rukas. I can't believe they changed it to Rukas. Rascal was so much better. Okay guys, let's go ahead and finish this battle. I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I have just used, um, I think, two, one Fong Star Smash and one Supernova, or actually, like, um, one Fong Star Smash and two Supernovas, and I have completely took out the pets. So, um, now I'm just gonna claim my ch chest reward, and then we can go ahead and see if there's a lava rock inside that snow pile we had. So, let's see. I'm gonna go inside. And yes, we got a lava rock. So now let's see how many lava rocks we have. Let's go here, info. Yes, we have two thirds lava rocks. Now all we need to do is just we need to collect one more lava rock and then we can track Mad Mayhem. Then all we have is, is, is this obsidian and then we have one more awesome epic. So let's go ahead and head over um, back to the um, like the main plaza place what I'm trying to say let's go up here so we just passed over box comfy rug so honestly and I'm like a lot of shovel chill mountains videos I keep on saying that Bach he's like a king he has the throne room as you remember in the quest if you don't then we can always go there sometime in any video there's no rush it's never gonna disappear unless prodigy makes it but then Bach won't have a kingdom and then he'll get mad and then the whole prodigy kingdom will go into war again probably ice and sand will be allied and fire and whatnot my imagination goes wild don't mind that Okay, so as you can see, Bach is the king. He's drinking hot cocoa and welcoming new strangers and wizards over to his place. Also friends. We're probably his friends since we completed the quests. If you haven't, you're still helping him. Say so your friends in progress. Far friends. There's many friends. But anyways, back to the point. So Bach has a very ch a very nice fireplace. A very warm rug and a delicious looking chocolate sofa that you can just like rest on and scoop some chocolate out of it and eat it while resting and then it looks like some biscuit pillows it looks so good but i think Pro i think the reason why prodigy made him standing and not near the fireplace is because he's a yeti he's already warm so this fireplace is for other wizards to warm up as you can see mira storm chaser is warming up let's go up now so guys, let's go ahead and now, since I op already opened the snow pile here, I mean, there's proof because there's like a small snow left, let's go ahead and battle, um, let's go ahead and battle this monster right here, and then this one so we can go into the cave. I'll, I'll show, we'll, we'll battle this one together, and then this one I'll do so you don't have to watch the boring part, and only the fun ones. Okay, so it's just one ice thing that's pretty good. Let's just use Fogster Smashes so we can save up for an all-out attack. <coughs> Ooh, excuse me. I still have a little bit of that cold. Don't mind that. Okay, so the ice sneak, we're using Snowling Ball. Um, so the thing is, Prodigy these days, they make them uh, monsters like in the normal world, like the wizard world. 
like too easy to battle. Like they a lot of do like one thousand, two thousand damage. Like if you're at level one hundred and they're at eighty five, and like sometimes they even miss. In Harmony Island, it's a whole different story. There's like many different pets. Some of them are level hundred and do use runes, and it's kind of tricky. But you can you can lose the battle very easily. Also, one more question I have for Prodigy, if you're watching this, in the Switch pets, which which pets are both of these? Like, they maybe they can put like a small picture of a Drago and a Krila, but like these don't, these monsters don't look anything, don't look like anything we have in the game. So, could you please explain which pets those are? Thank you. Okay, so now let's go ahead and use this attack. And what? Five hundred and fifty-one health. Like I said again, maybe he could have left like a little bit more, like at least two thousand. So it's worthy, and or at least took it out completely. But why the disgrace, the audacity to still stay with like five hundred and fifty-one hearts when you had eight thousand something? Okay, guys, let's go ahead and solve this. It's very easy. The perks of setting the grade to lower so you can get on with the video and not watch me doing boring questions. Yes, yeah, so at the end we got a spell power bonus. That's pretty nice. Um, so the thing is, I haven't been talking to my pets very recently, and they've been arguing too much. Y as you see, Pyromane is a fire horse, and Mystical is like a unicorn, it's like an ice one, and they have been arguing too much. So far, Mystical's been winning, but Pyromane's been gathering up her heat because we've been bonfire spire a lot during the charred fruit, and they've been battling. So guys, if you have any suggestions to help me stop them from fighting so that they don't get too overboard, please let me know. Because fire and ice, they just can't get along. Oh wait, I had the perfect idea. Since since this person behind Captain Zoe, uh, she left. But but um, shout out to her, whoever she was. She actually she had a chill and jar, and that is the perfect example that ice and fire can go along just as nice as mystical and pyromane. As you can see, this is the all-out attack we've been waiting for to use. So let's go ahead and use that real quick. I was like thinking for a second, like, like nah, let's go for it, cause why not? So, um, let's quickly do this question. Oh, I almost glitched out. I clicked enter two times, and it said correct, and it flashed this skill complete. So, it's been a long time since this badge has came. Mixed operations rank two. All right, we got it. Oh yes, we used your team used all attack. I just love all attacks, but the thing that's weird is when the all attack happened, only the pyromane showed, and the mystical and me got like white out. So um, they ran away. We won the battle. It's pretty good, pretty good. Let's go ahead and go collect our snow pile now. Actually, I don't want snow pile. We need to go collect our charred rock hidden in the snow pile. So guys, here's a tip so that your your so here's a trip here's a tip <laughs> if you've collected the obsidian and the um what was the first one the charred fruit already and you've been waiting for a while before you played in prodigy to collect the rest. So my tip here for you is that you should probably um throw the charred rock into the frozen something so that it stays warm so that we can track Mag 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 Mayhem more easily and he won't run away from the cold. I'm just kidding, guys. That was a joke. It's not a real tip, so don't try to throw it into the frozen something. So um we're going to go ahead and battle this ice snake. I'm going to go ahead and be right back. Okay guys, here's the final scene where I'm just finishing off this poor little shade who's trying his best to show that he's a comedian but fails and hardly does any damage to us. So, um, here's the thing, here's the spells that I did. So first I used Sneaking Vine which did a whopping 5,000 damage with a spell power bonus which was like 100 more over to the Ice Sneak or whatever pet was there. I think it was an Ice Sneak, yeah it probably was. And then, um, after that, I used Totality from Luma, Luma's Attack, Totality. See, so I already used that, so you, I can't use any more. I hit Storm's Wrath, Forest Fury, Frigid Blast, Tidal Twister, Hot Snow, Thermal Prism. Um, I, I like the name of Tsunami, it sounds pretty cool. And Totality, obviously, I already used that. Or Umbra Blast. Umbra Blast is one I don't understand, it's just weird. The rest I do. So, um, Sneaking Vine is a very underrated attack. All, all Harmony Island attacks, runes, and spells, and stuff on it is underrated. So you have to, like, check those out if you haven't already. It'll really, really help you in your battles. Like, if you have, like, 5,000 health left, and you don't want to waste two Fogstar Smashes or Supernova, go ahead and use Sneaking Vine if you have enough energy. 
Let's use Flying Star Smash though since I don't want to waste any energy so we can get on with this. So since this is like um, a long type question, I'm going to be using a calculator to solve this. So um, I just need to... How far I just need to drive? Wait, so this question is confusing. It says this person, he drives 20.45 kilometers to school and then 12.78. How far does he need to drive? What is it asking? Oh, he's asking how far did he drive? Prodigy words these questions weirdly. Like this video if you agree that this question was weirded. Very strangely. Okay, there we got it. Okay, let's go ahead and use a spell and the shade is dead. Um, as you can see, we did the 5,000 damage even with the, um, even with, like, the Harmony Island thing on and without. Actually, like, with the Harmony Island, um, bandana that I put on, I got from the rewards, the groovy shades. I did extra damage with the power bonus, so Harmony Island is very good thing to, like, have. Like, our items from Harmony Island is basically my point. If I confused you all too much, that's what I'm trying to say, but, yeah. Okay, as you can see, we have the snow lump right here. Let's go ahead and go over to it. And we got blast powder and lava rock. What's blast powder? Looks like a completed task. Come find me. So let's go ahead and um, track down Olab. First, let's go ahead and go to the miner. Oh, we already did that. those tasks. Anyways, let's go ahead and track down Olab. First, let's go ahead and check out what blast powder is. I can all sh so I can show all of them. Alright guys, here I am. I just searched Blast Powder Prodigy. As you can see, our first result is from the Prodigy Math Game fandom. If you don't know, the the this is like the legit Prodigy guide to all things. So make sure to check that out. Let's go ahead and go over to it. So, um, the Blast Powder, it's a quest item. And, um... So, it's the blast from Arcturian's cannon. So strong it turns ice to dust. So, it's com so this is needed for it to... Arcturion to, uh, to obtain that epic space, basically. So let's go ahead and close this tab now. Let's head back to Prodigy. So let's go ahead and now go over to our mythical epics. As you can see, let's go ahead and click on Info. And we already got one-fifth of Blast Powder. As you can see, that's what we need. Um, so now let's go ahead and close out of this. We got two-thirds of Magma Hem. But we still need to tame him that way. So let's go ahead and go find Ulla and trade for her. So I'm going to go um, back to Mythical Epics. Um, Magma Ham. I was just there, so I just closed out. That was very stupid of me. So let's go ahead and go press. Go trade. I, I just love that music symbol because Ulla plays the flute. So it's the, the wonderful, sweet melody. Oh, look, we have a box of something here. Let's go ahead and check that out. Oh, wait, what's this buddy? A mummy puppy. What's a mummy puppy? We'll check that out after. But first, let's go ahead and open this crate. So we got gold and copper coins. Let's go ahead and go over to Ulla now. Okay, there she is. Oh, hello again. Would you care for a tree? That are my favorite snack. So soft and so, and so sweet. Ulla says the same thing over and over again, even when she's not f um fluffing up marshmallows. So Prodigy has to fix this, I think. So we got some curious items. Let's see what we brought. Let's track Mythic. So goodbye, young wizard. If you find some more clues, then next time we meet, I'll use them to locate the epic you see. Hey, she speaks in rhymes. That's pretty cool. So let's track the epic now. Go tame. So we're tracking Bagmahim. It looks like we've come it looks like we've like sparkle. It's coming from there. Um Oh, so there is Bagmahim. So um, you guys, what what do you think? Maybe I should first tame him, or I should collect all this obsidian. Let's go ahead and go tame him, since we're already here, because why not? So, let us let me go ahead and battle both these monsters. monsters. I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I just finished off the ash that It was so cute, I feel sad for battling it, almost. So, now we have this Hobbs, or like this, um, puck over here. So let's go ahead and battle this little monster, and I'll be fast forwarding it up, and then we'll go ahead and take Magmaham to the.
guys, here we are at the final moment. Well, not the final moment, the almost final moment. Where we're gonna tame Magma Ham two thirds and then the Obsidian, then taming him again and finally claiming him. Let's go ahead and go ahead and, uh, go approach him now maybe some make some small talk give him a gift and then battle him i'm just kidding let's just go for it why are we just standing here why don't we just go up to him well it's because my ladybug is a bit shy she hates lava because once um my pet mag mischief and not mag mayhem because i don't have him yet burned her aunt's wings and now she can't fly so her name is shelly by the way Let's go ahead and battle the monster now. Don't don't worry, don't worry, Shelly. Don't be afraid. We have six battle turns left, I think, in total for taming Magnahem. So we have to be very careful in our questions. This is why I use a calculator. Let's use a uh, Flongster Smash to complete the subtract the subtraction statement. So, um, see, this is about correct. I think it is. So we will, we won't be needing our calculator. I completed that skill. That's pretty easy in the fast forward. So we used th that much spell power bonus. So a magma have just like pound. You're out of here. Now let's do sneaking vine. Complete the subtraction statement. Uh, let's see. Nope, not that. Um. So you probably don't want to see me sit here and do boring math. So I'll just quickly do this. Um. See, yep, this is correct. I'm just taking extra time because I want to be make, make sure it's like perfectly correct because I don't want to do any less damage to Magmahem because we only have a couple of battle turns left. He's using Iron Cannon. Oh, he missed. He's stop Fogster Smash now. Now we only have three battle turns left. That's perfect for when we get all the Obsidian. So let's see. Um, I have to subtract. I think like what? Four. Just check one last time. Um. Nope, that's not correct. It is actually. I just got confused. I thought it was one point zero nine. Okay. So we just we just finished taming Magnum two thirds. Yes, I'm so excited. The obsidian. I know if it, all the locations where it is. Well, I'm pretty sure I know. I have a hunch. Um, wait, I thought we finished taming Magnahem, though. Why is it making me battle him more? What? Why? You guys, what is this? Is this a weird prodigy glitch? This is not fair. Um, okay, let's see. Um. Okay. So I'm not supposed to sure what what I'm supposed to do with these hints. So let's see. Okay, so basically I think what it's trying to say is I'm supposed to like do um let's see. So this is this is not it. Um Okay, so I'm now I'm gonna try a new option now. Yes, this is perfect! I got a perfect fit! Yay! So, let's go ahead and use our spell now. And finish off the Mad Mayhem. Well, not finish off, but we got him. Now, we only have two battle turns left. We have to be really, really careful when we finish taming Mad Mayhem. So, we got 11 stars each. We don't need for each, just the mystical. So, so the mystical kind of feels left out, but that's alright. We don't care, do we? Let's open our chest. Okay, so we just got like three dinky gold coins. That's 25, but still. So now in the, in the mythical epics, all we need to do is go collect the obsidian. It's fishes in shipwreck shore. Let's go, guys. 
Alright guys, here we are in Shipwreck Shore. Now we're just going to need to be going over to the Mythical Epics and checking how much obsidian we have. We have 1 out of 3. We got the 1 when we are going to check out Oh, well, when you collected our charred fruit in that video. Once again, if you want to check that out, click the I at the top of this video on the right corner. Okay guys, so it looks like we need to battle a quick little truckle to get to the top. Let's go ahead and battle the truckle. I'll be really quick. Okay guys, so fast forward, we finished that battle, and we battled the Aquaster guarding the sand pile over here. So let's go ahead and open up the sand pile. Hopefully it has obsidian, and yes it does! So now I just have a hunch it won't be here, because let's just check. Yep, we have two trip drops, and then link up to the whirlpool. That's kind of useless, because there's need nothing even up here. And we can still click on the islands, so but we won't, we won't find anything. Not even a billy foot dog. Let's head up now. And, uh, oh, a river neek. I haven't seen one of those in forever. I love river neeks. They're the best. So, guys, if we, if we, if we want to avoid this battle, then we have to go, we have to go straight up to the mast right here. Oh, we almost got to the equester. We have to go straight to the right and then down. So then we can enter the sand pile without attracting anyone, I think. So let's try, though. And, yes, we got the obsidian. I'm so happy. So now since we have all the obsidian, Ulla says we, we completed a task. Let's go find her. So let's go ahead and find Ulla. Uh, let's trade with her. She's in Bonfire Spire, as usual, because Magnahan lives there. So we're supposed to follow the music notes. So it's coming from up there. And, um, we can't cross that out right now. We found her. Oh, and look, she's frying marshmallows. That looks so good. I just seriously, I seriously want some. I, I love her cute little pet. I want that so badly. It looks like a version of Snow Fluff, except, like, covered in crystals. I think that might be a pet in the future. We, we might get after completing all those tasks. That's my hypothesis. Oh, hello again. Would you care for his treat? They're my favorite snacks, so soft and so sweet. She says that every time, even when um she's playing the flute, so that's kind of weird. It looks like she's eating the chocolate flute or marshmallow flute. And she talks in rhymes. Again, treat sweet. So again doesn't rhyme, so that's like a one. It's, it's a, like a one, two, two types rhyming, if you get what I mean. So it looks like we've got some things. So we collected all of these. Now we just need to give the obsidian. Sand that has been mental, melted into a kind of glass. It takes something very hot to do that. Now let's go ahead and track the mythic now. Goodbye, young wizard. Find some more clues. And the next time we meet, I'll use them to locate the epic you see. I just love how she says that. So um, now we can go to about and stats because we have her. And sh um, so he has 400 hearts. Are you kidding me? At least make it like uh level 95 like i thought it was but no it's you gotta make it that level oh, come on okay let's go ahead and track magma him now and we're gonna claim him i'm so excited let's go tame so i'm pretty sure he'll be down down here somewhere i don't see any sparkles at all oh why why don't we see any sparkles does it mean we don't know where he is you guys, what's going on? When we track him, we don't see anything. Uh. Okay, guys, I'm gonna look around for a bit, and once I find where Mad Mayhem is hidden and the sparkles, I'll go ahead and let you. Okay, guys, I found out what the problem was. It turns out I just needed to go back to my pet book, go to Mythical Epics, and track him again. If this problem ever happens to you, so follow along right now. So you can X out the tracking. Go to pets, go to mythical epics, like as usual you do, and then go to Mag Mayhem, and press track again. Then let's go over back to Bonfire Spire, and no sparkles? What? Why is this happening again? He must be up here though, I can just assume that. Nope, he isn't. So that's what, why, why we need to do the tracking one last time. So, info, track. Go to Bonfire Spire. And look, voila, we have the sparkles again. So, um, if this ever happens once again, just do that and you'll probably get it back. If this doesn't happen, keep trying. And if it doesn't work still, then contact Prodigy Support Team and they'll be very happy to help you. Um, this might, might be a glitch sometimes. Instead of, like, 
they must get a lot of requests each day about people that like don't get the gifts out of my member box that like they're supposed to. So they must be very busy. So unless it's really urgent after refreshing and long time, then go make sure to um contact them. So let's go ahead and follow the sparkles. And there is Magma Ham. And Kiara's hiding up there. Hey, Kiara. How are you doing? You're a cute little brow. I love brows. So, um, she's level 21. Um, can't add any fr more friend requests. So, I'll, I'll add some. Oh, no, she's already gone. That's okay. So, let's go ahead and battle this flame meek real quick. Um, so excited. We'll just do this together. I'll use an epic attack. Uh, how about Frigid Blast? Since we're going to do Arcturian after this video. So, let's see. Um, I'm pretty sure it's this. Nope, it isn't. So I'm probably gonna like mess around with this for a bit until I get it. Um, yeah, I got it there. So um, I can't wait until I get to the Mad Mayhem battle because if there's only two battle turns left and I don't make it, I'm gonna be so sad because after all that effort, we still don't get Mad Mayhem. I'm probably just gonna like rage quit and probably get Mad Mayhem all over again from the start and then start at the part again if we can do that. Or I'll just I'll just contact Prodigy if this happens. So oh, look, exactly five thousand health. That's that. How is that a coincidence? So, um, now, let's see. Yep, it's this. Oh, no, 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 I got it wrong, I got it wrong, I got it wrong. How did I get it wrong, though? Oh, I see. Let's see. Oh, it's the same answer. I'm so, cr I'm so, like, crazy. Um... There, we got it. Finally, this annoying skill is over. I mean, I know it's easy and all, but just time consuming. Like, there's a difference between, there's a thin line between time consuming and if you know the skill or not. Are you kidding me? 325 health? You guys, why is Prodigy doing this to me? Did I do something wrong? Uh, okay, let's just use two supernova then. Oh, this is not so bad. So we have to round it to the nearest hundredth. It's very easy. We got it. So we don't have to like spend so much time on battles anymore now that we know it. Please go out monsters. I'm tired of battling you all. And yes, finally the monsters are gone. Sorry if I did you a jump scare. I just had to do that. Okay, well, let's go as a friendship group all the way to the Mad Mayhem. So we so as a parade, Mystical even leveled up for us. Thank you, Mystical, for stealing the show. Um my, so let's see, just need to open this member box, and wha bam we got just some golden hot hots, now for the moment we've all been waiting for, battling Mag Mayhem, let's go, hee hee hee, I'm thinking of a prank for Ulla, since, since she thinks marshmallows are so soft and fluffy, how to thinks, how does she, how does she think of some soft and fluffy storm cloud? Take some storm cloud, put it on a stick, and save it for a little later. Ha ha ha. Oh, sorry, where was I again? Whoops, you heard about all about my plan. Hopefully, you'll stick with me to prank Ella since she keeps on eating her flute, saying it's a marshmallow. Let's go ahead and battle Mad Mayhem now. We're just like, we're just like standing right next to him. Oh, so we just went into him. Oh, we have five battle turns. Yay! I'm so happy. Um, so we we just, we, we didn't get just two. So I'm gonna use a tsunami. Since we can use that. So we're supposed to round it to the nearest tenth. Let's do that. I'm so glad the questions are easy. So getting Mad Mayhem will be a breeze. Okay, so, um, we almost tamed him. Hopefully we can use all the battle terms so that we don't have any left over. Uh, he does so much less damage now. What happened to you, Mag Mayhem? Are you on level 5 or something? That would be very bad if he was on level 5. Because I expected him to be on level 95. Because, like, all the other people, all my friends, they got on level 95. So I think Prodigy maybe patched it. I don't know. We'll check it out. We're about to finish the battle anyways. So, guys, make sure to tune in till the end. Since we've already made it to this part. It's been getting quite long now. So I should be ending off quite soon. Once we play around with Mag Mayhem a little bit.
Yes, we got Mag Mayhem. This is a, I'm so happy. Uh, this is probably a future meme or something. But anyways, um, we finally got Mag Mayhem. I'm so happy. Um, we should have got at least more Battle Stars. I'm, I can't believe I'm complaining about Battle Stars. Once we got the Mag Mayhem. I don't know why I'm getting so excited. There's like, a, there's gonna be like, um, the. Oh, we got two Mag Mayhems? What is that? Oh, one's a buddy. So let's um put on follow me. And we got Mag Mayhem. I'm so happy. Add to team. Let's do that. So it's oh, it's on level 93. I'm so um that's not so bad after all. So I'll add him to my team. And in place of Pyromane. And now we have a cool new buddy following us. Alright guys, that's all for today. Oh looks like see someone has the same eyes and hairstyle as us, but well let's let's try that again at home. Well so so here's let, let's make a video like a, not not a video but a small clip of welcoming Mag Mayhem to our new home. Hey Mag Mayhem, this is your new home. How do you like it? Mag Mayhem, I hate it. It's so cold and icy. I like places that are well warm. I'm out of here. No, but Mag Mayhem, you're not going anywhere. I'll just make you a separate small fire fire themed um area so let's see uh this 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 will be mad mayhem's area he'll just relax there while the time goes by all right guys that's all for today in this video we finished taming mad mayhem and we finally got him that was so exciting i love spending time with you all it's probably the most exciting video of all almost one the most exciting one was when i spent the most time with you and um once again if, if you haven't subscribed to my channel make sure to hit the subscribe button and like this video if you haven't already and click the notification bell so you won't miss out on any of my prodigy videos bye guys I'm